All right, y'all already know this is the last one here for this Fortnite Chapter 3 Season 2 Covert Ops quest to establish a device uplink in Zero Build. And as you guys were able to see, this is going to be the last quest that gives you guys whatever that free pickaxe is supposed to be. I don't know how cool or how relevant that pickaxe is supposed to be for the final reward for this quest, but we are working towards it. And of course, again, if you guys haven't completed any of them prior, I don't think up to this point you guys are even going to be able to touch it. But while we wait to get into a match here, if you guys didn't know, again, Again, we are doing a giveaway here on the channel every 100 subscribers we are giving away things for you guys in the item shop or a battle pass and so all you guys got to do to enter for this giveaway completely free a hundred percent up to luck in this case is drop a like on the video subscribe to the channel of course and then down in the comments below leave your epic ID along with what you guys would rather have a battle pass or something from the item shop that way if you guys are the winner I can actually end up adding you guys and then seeing what you guys would prefer and then send it to you guys right on the spot but all right establishing another zero point and this time we're gonna go kind of near rocky reels i think if anybody happens to know what the story is lore wise for fortnite right now in this season thus far let me know down in the comments below i haven't kept up too much i just know that apparently we still haven't gotten our ability to build back i guess but anyways here we go let's get this All right, so for this quest in particular, it says plan timed explosives at an IO airship command cavern or the fortress in zero build. So I clearly don't have a gun or anything, but we do need to get on that airship and we're gonna have to try to be a little sneaky about this one. I can't believe I'm already getting shot at. This is crazy. Oh, this quest is definitely going to be a little bit difficult because even though it shows you where you need to kind of place it in terms of the explosives anyway, you guys do see the exclamation points to let you guys know that obviously on the airship you need to place it somewhere. But because you don't really know where you have to go through basically three layers or three levels of the airship, you're basically running around looking for an actual spot to place them. Okay, so there's apparently one in that room over there, which is good to know. So we definitely know where at least one of the spots are going to be for these timed explosives. So I'm going to see if I can actually get into that little room at the bottom. No, dude, he's already there. I'm literally playing ring around the rosy with these guys right now. Let's try to go for a second attempt. Oh my god, what the? Oh, he's camping the spot, this dude. I can't believe it. What a rat. Honestly, no matter which location you guys go to for airships, whether it's going to be here at Rocky Reels, because there's obviously a fight going on right now. Tilted Towers is always busy, and then going to the cavern is going to be busy as well. And then even going to the fortress, I, I think, you know, no matter what, obviously it's going to depend on what the bus route for you guys is going to be, but it's going to be busy so much. But I think I'm going to spice it up a little bit, and instead of going to all these airships, I'm going to try going to the drill over here. It might be a dumb idea. I know it's going to be pretty busy, but I feel like if I can at least take control of this for the most part, I'll also get a chance to fight Sloane and then get her mythic, so that should work out for us. What is going on with this guy? I can't even take a break right now because it seems like someone's trying to fight Sloane. And they won, I guess. I found the right one. Okay, well I finally hit my shots, and I've just about cleared this area out, now I can actually go and look around. So I was at the top of this for the most part, so I feel like it's gotta be somewhere in the bottom, right? Okay, so there's one right there. Okay, so they're like literally on the outside. This should be a lot easier if you guys are gonna go for this one instead of doing the blimps. There can only be one other spot it could be. It's gotta be right here. There we go. And... Nice. 
And with that, I believe that is going to be pretty much everything for this quest line yet again. So we should have been rewarded our pickaxe already. We don't have the quest here anymore. So all right, even though it was, again, a lackluster thing, not enough quests or anything like that, it's done and it's completed. So story-wise, I feel like because obviously, you know, he's going to be talking to multiple loopers. And instead of having all of these battles take place individually, one over at Rocky Reels and then the previous one and so on, all of us as a looper, we're basically just going to be putting all of these timed remote explosives, the C4s, the dynamite. Like somebody puts them over here at the fortress. Somebody puts them over there at the tilted towers. And we put another one at the cavern. And then pretty much the end result is literally going to be a continuous explosion where all of the locations and their blimps are going to be destroyed pretty much at the same time. But if you guys remember seeing some of the leaks from before where the final battle remains at the cavern, then I'm assuming what's really going to happen, it's going to go something like Dr. Sloan was able to find the ones that were at the cavern and kind of like stop them from blowing up, but everything else did end up still exploding. So I feel like it might go that route because that's where the last battle is gonna go as well also on the map i don't know if you guys ever noticed but if you guys check it out all of the io airships or the blimps or whatever they're all facing in a vertical direction so the tilted towers one the rocky reels one the condo canyon and the one that was also at the daily bugle those ones all face in a vertical direction where the command cavern one is only facing in the horizontal direction and all the ones that have been facing vertically so far are the ones that are usually getting destroyed so that basically makes me believe that command cavern is going to be the last one standing there so tilted towers is obviously going to be next rocky reels is about to go down just like all the rest of them prior but i don't know that's just my thoughts let me know what you guys think because if you guys have any better theories i would love to hear about it all right well this guy is basically gonna get away i think but i'm gonna end up the video here thank you guys so much for watching if you guys enjoyed it remember to drop that like subscribe if you haven't already turn on notification hitting the bell icon next to the subscribe button that way it out when i upload new videos here to the channel and remember to leave your epic id down in the comments below along with what you guys would rather win a battle pass or something from the item shop that would be great either way thank you guys again for watching catch on the flip side arts out oh and i almost forgot this is the harvesting tool you guys get the secret sledge lovingly crafted to blend into the sledgehammer's natural habitat i guess it's not related to the story i don't know what was the point of this